Okay guys, so this is going to be a quick story time on why I needed a thong so badly. Okay, so around this time, I don't even know what year it was, but around this time, my favorite movie came out, it was called 13. They had thongs, they had, they were smoking, they were drinking, you know, they were doing some wild shit. Now that I'm putting it together in my mind, I might have been 13. Anywho, that's neither here nor there. So, well it is here or there. Okay, well anyway, so back to the story. So at this point in my life, I decided that I needed a thong. I didn't care where it came from, I just needed a thong. Weird, but I needed it. It would have been too weird to just go to my mom and ask for a thong. Um, it would have been weird to go to my sisters and ask for one of theirs. It, it just like, I needed a thong. <laughs> I needed it. So one day we were at the store and I was with my two big sisters and my mother. We were at the store and my mom was like, you guys need to have these type of underwear so the underwear lines aren't showing, right? So my two big sisters start going thong shopping. They picked out thongs. In my mind at this point in time, I was like, this is my perfect opportunity to start picking out thongs too. So I did. This is me shopping in the store. Thongs everywhere. I was so fucking ready to have my mom purchase these thongs. Like, I was amped. Like, I was fucking amped. And then my sisters looked at me and they were like, Mom's not gonna get you those. And I was like, wait, what? Like, what? And then, so we get to the register and my mom's like, whose are these? She picked up all my thongs. Awkward. My sisters were like, those are Tamika's, right? Threw me under the bus. They're like, those are Tamika's. So, I, I was just like, oh, you know, I was just acting like, um, you know, I didn't mean to pick up the thongs. You know, I, mean, I thought I was getting a thong. So, my mom ended up putting my thongs aside and getting everyone else's thongs. They had like 20 thongs to each of them. I was pissed. I was so fucking pissed off. So, we get in the car and I was silent the whole ride. I was just so fucking quiet. And I was pissed and I was like, you know, when I turn 18, I'm leaving. I'm done with this fucking house. Like, I'm done with you guys. Like, I was pissed. So then, I got home and guess what the fuck I did? Guess. I cut up all my underwear. I cut the butt out of all my granny panties and I had the thong that I always wanted. I went to school and I showed all my girlfriends my new thong. They're like, oh my god, how'd you get a thong? Show me, show me. So I was in the bathroom like lifting it up, like showing them my thong or whatever. And um, <laughs> they literally thought it was the coolest thing ever. They're like, oh my god, Tamika, can you do mine? Can you do mine? Can you do mine? I was like, yeah, like just bring it to my house. I'll cut them up. Bitch, I had a thong company with no money. Hmm. Yeah, so that's that entire story. It wasn't really that progressive. I just wanted you guys to know that I cut my underwear out to make a thong. Very weird. Years later, I bought my own thongs. And then years after that, I stopped wearing underwear completely. <laughs> I'm a wreck. I'm a wreck. So the moral of this story is if you want something, fucking go and get it. Don't let nobody tell you now. Or make another way so that you can get it. Cut those bitches up. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the story time. Um, it's a little awkward for me that I cut my underwear. Is that weird? Is that weird to you? <laughs> it's weird to me. But um, yeah.